Why do cats are always awake at night? Having a cat who keeps you awake all night or insists on waking you at the crack of dawn is a common complaint. There is a logical reason for the behavior though. A cat's natural circadian rhythm, their 24-hour body clock, tells them when to sleep, rise and eat, just like ours does. The problem is, humans are diurnal, which means, more active during the daytime. While domestic cats are crepuscular, which means they are most active at dawn and dusk. So when we're trying to sleep, our cats are often wide awake, hunting, their next meal. The good news is that, having a cat does not mean you need to be constantly sleep deprived. There are things you can do to guide your cat's body clock so it's more in tune with your own. Rule out health issues first. If your cat wanders restlessly at night and meows constantly, he may have an underlying medical problem that is causing pain or discomfort. Senior cats may also have feline dementia which can cause night calling. It's prudent to get a vet checkup before working on changing the behaviors that are keeping you awake at night. On the other hand, if your cat is in the pink of health, try the following suggestions. Number 1. During the day. If you did nothing but sleep all day, how tired do you think you'd be at bedtime? Not very right? It's much the same for your cat. Yes, cats naturally sleep more than we do, but the more active he is during the day, the more likely it is he'll sleep at night. Incorporate a variety of enrichment activities which not only encourage physical exertion but mental stimulation and adventure. This is especially important if you're away from home all day. Leave out several different interactive toys for your cat to play with, and swap them out regularly to prevent boredom. Tall cat trees or perches situated by a window are always feline favorites. Set up a kitty maze with several soft fabric tunnels, and leave a Made for Cats DVD playing on the TV. A food puzzle is a great way to engage their brain. Consider building them a catio, climbing shelves, or a catwalk, and provide lots of scratching opportunities. Number 2. In the evening. After a long day at work, you may just want to relax with your cat on your lap while watching some TV. However, a little extra playtime in the evening can pay off big, with more sleep for you. A key component of merging your cat's sleep-wake schedule with your own involves a last play session and meal about an hour before your bedtime. This is because a cat's natural pattern is hunt, feast, groom and sleep, in that order. So the idea is to tucker them out with play, and then give them their last meal, after which they will groom and hopefully go to sleep. Don't skip that last playtime or last meal unless you enjoy having your cat waking you up at 4 a.m. demanding for breakfast. Number 3. Offer a snack. Generally speaking, most cats do better with scheduled meal times rather than being allowed to free feed. Certainly, having timed meals is important for them. You could, however, leave a handful of treats in a timed feeder that dispenses them at night. This may teach your cat's penchant for waking you at dawn for food. Number 4. Ignore, ignore, ignore. This last suggestion is by far the hardest thing for most cat owners to do. But it's probably the most important. When your cat wakes you up in the middle of the night or at dawn, you must ignore them completely. Don't respond or even open your eyes. Most especially, do not get up and feed them or play with them, because that is payoff. Even pushing your cat off the bed is considered a payoff in your cat's mind. If you show your cat night after night that nothing is going to happen when they pester you to get up, the behavior will eventually stop. The problem most people have is that it's going to take time. Sometimes, a lot of time.
It might mean 10 days to two weeks of really long, sleep-deprived nights. It's also important to realize that when you begin ignoring a behavior that worked for your cat in the past, they may initially ramp up the effort to get your attention before eventually giving up on the behavior. So while you might think it's not working and be tempted to give up, just don't. Keep reminding yourself that it is possible to get your sleep back, but like any awesome thing worth having, it won't come easy. It won't happen overnight, but with patience and persistence, you can get to a point where your cat isn't keeping you awake all night long. Thank you for watching.